टेन स्टैंडर्ड सोशल साइंस जियाग्रफी चैप्टर टेन इंडिया जियाग्रफिकल पोजिशन एंड फिजिकल फीचर्स फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स विद सुटेबल वर्ड्स द नेम इंडिया इज डिराइव फ्रॉम द रिवर इंडस द टोटल एरिया ऑफ इंडिया इज डैश स्क्वेर किलोमीटर्स थर्टी टू लैक एटी सेवन थाउजेंड एंड टू सिक्सटी थ्री In the central part of India, dash north latitude passes the Tropic of Cancer, or 23 degree point 30 minute. The coastline of India with major landmass is dash kilometers 6100. The Indian physiography. has been divided into dash major parts four greater himalaya is also called dash himadri the highest mountain peak in the world is mount everest the north indian plain is made up of dash soil alluvial soil The Western Ghats in Karnataka are also called Sahyadri. Answer the following questions in brief. In which part of the Asian continent is India situated? South East. In which hemisphere of the earth is India located the northern hemisphere which is the southern tip of mainland of India Indira point In which island is Indira point located Great Nicobar Islands What is the other name for the foothills of the Himalayas Siwalik range which is the recently formed landmass in india siwalik range what are the advantages of himalayas they have influenced the life of indians to a greater extent they provide protection to india they obstruct the cold winds from the north asian regions they are the birthplace of many rivers they form vast plains they facilitate hydroelectric power generation they are the home to many types of plants and animals they are a great treasure house of minerals tourism and religious centers explain the extent of peninsular plateau they stretches from the south of the satluj ganga plains up to the indian ocean in the south its total area is around 16 lakh square kilometer it stretches from the aravalli mountains in the north to kanyakumari in the south it extends approximately 1400 kilometers from the western ghats in the west to the rajmahal hills of jharkhand in the east a triangular shape being broad in the north and narrow towards the south it is bounded by the arabian sea bay of bengal and the indian ocean right about the shivalik range these hills are the most recent formations they are located in the southern part they have lesser height they are also called the foot hills of the himalayas these hills have narrow strips of plains called dunes these are about 600 to 1500 meters above the sea level
The northern plains are also called deposited plains. Why? They are formed by the deposition of alluvial soils brought down, brought by the rivers which rises in the Himalayas. Mention the differences between Western and Eastern Ghats. Western Ghats located in the west of the Deccan Plateau. Eastern Ghats located in the east of the Deccan Plateau. They are very high or continuous. They are not very high or continuous. Anaimudi peak is the highest peak. Armakonda and Mahindragiri are the highest peaks. They are not separated by river valleys here and there. They are separated by river valleys here and there. 